I'll Go. rip one. One person. <laughs> like we need a group. I'd like person. to do the A team. <laughs> okay. Who's in? How many people are in each group? Uh, four. That's the. So you're gonna have a group of splitting the party is a ridiculous idea. Ignore. No. Yeah. 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 You guys can split the party if you want to. We're gonna dress the um, George Sakai up as the reigning king. I was gonna say we could have one team run defense as a distraction for the nice time. Okay, split the party. Let's go. I am going to kill you guys if you split the party. That's like rule one of D and D. So wait, we have. I have gate. Yeah. Try to navigate into okay. the throne room. Oh. Okay. The monkey. You approach. She he steals my phone. The room. Okay. He tries to room. my phone. You see Goggle Never Remember. He's sitting there me. collecting money. <laughs> Hail, Lord, I've never remember. Uh, he, we come in great rolls. urgency. I'm staring he at because he's a monkey, so he does the same. Begins asking why you're here. Takes pictures of his balls. Lord, yeah. never remember. We have come for one you and only one reason. You got to take a monkey. To complete our film. Okay, why do you need to do that? I'm willing to help. Unfortunately, we've had some trouble with our special effects coordinator, and the lighting has been off the last two scenes. <laughs> okay. Isn't that right, Harrison? Uh, I'm, I'm still in the middle of calculating. He claims that a mirror that he's seen in your palace here might be able to shed the kind of light we need. To teleport to a place that no one has access to. Uh, the moment you hear it... Mm. He draws his right hand out. I'm afraid I cannot allow this. A power is brewing, and I will be on the winning side. Roll initiative. Excellent. No, no, no. Roll. We have no interest in having combat with this guy, do we? Does anyone want to kill this guy? Uh, the DM just told us to roll initiative, so we're fighting. Okay, he got a five. Oh wow. Ah, I got a nat twenty. Okay, everyone. And a five. You. So I got 25 total. I got okay, one nat 20 and a 5. Why are you rolling initiative with advantage? I just I just pushed initiative there. Really. You, you, you just rolled a nat 20. You got a 20 to your initiative. Yeah, so I just put, yeah, I just clicked initiative roll and it just gave me two d20s. Uh, yeah, so right. just, just use... Uh, I don't, yeah, just use the first one that shows up. Okay, so 20. You got 20. Ryan, initiative. I got a 7. I'm at 18. Okay. Uh, um, when you're running like 45 10. browser tabs and you get a pop up, what do you do? Disable pop ups. You disable pop ups. So just have open tabs. So you go first? Yeah, 20. He rolled 18, he rolled 10, he rolled a 7. Okay, you're up first. Roll an attack roll against Daggled, Daggled Neverember. Lord of Neverwinter and Waterdeep. But he was—he's not an elected lord, right? Yeah, no, he got through your through bureaucratic incompetence, the legal system. So attack him. You seem very eager for me to attack him. For yeah. Reason. Why? Yeah. I'm not telling. He's a swing. Some of my favorite episodes. Okay, uh, roll. I love Strange New World. I do not know where. It's Look at the warp core. Yeah. One of the best engineering. He's extremely shiny. Okay. Uh, I got hooked with uh, Sulu. Just attack. Uh, what was his initiative roll? You got a five. You can attack him. He's going last. Okay. Just attack him. I don't like the. I mean, that's peer pressure. Why we don't want to attack? Will, okay, I'm not going to attack him directly. I will use a distance attack then. So I will use. I'll use calling light. Call light. Okay. Uh, uh, roll your damage. Uh. Got a three on a save. Uh, yeah. Attack save, dexterity, eighteen. He fails. Roll oh. damage. Okay, so this is the third turn. Wait, where the hell? What dice am I rolling? Okay, creature takes three d10s. Okay. One, two, three. Roll. Ah. Uh, 15. He dies. 
Um, that was just cleave never remember in half. Uh, no, he just I, blew up with lightning. No, I actually deep fried him. <laughs> as he falls, he says, I will rise again with Vecna's return. I yeah. have we no stick the doubt. body in Dillon's bag of death. <laughs> okay. You know, you know, you know this we reminds me of the mirror. Okay, Brian, jump through the mirror. Jump through the mirror. So you pass by your slightly more handsome version of yourself. Slightly. Yes, just yes. slightly. Just like a hair. Yeah, it's just like kind of like an alternate high. universe. There's you one know? point in the stats. So instead of being a one extra 18, it's a 19. Instead of being a 19, it's a 20. I have 20 charisma, so it's so 21. It's a 21 I got charisma. a 21 charisma myself. It's just handsomer than any human could possibly be, or any minotaur, but just so slightly. Damn. Just enough to be like infuriating. You know, I Damn. just I just thought of a reference from where that could that could possibly came from. What is it? Uh, has anyone played uh, Star Wars uh, Jedi Survivor? No, I have not. There's a boss enemy. There's literally a stormtrooper boss enemy that you literally just one shot with one swipe of your saber, and that j this just reminded me of that. Yeah, it's more based on. <laughs> It's a commonly used tactic of establishing a fight and then just not having it exist. <laughs> can't believe you killed the Lord of Neverland. Well, I guess that puts us in charge. Yeah. Did you put Cheez Its in the dip? Hey, after I Did killed you try it? After I killed the master of that. Uh, hey, we can put gum in the dip. Gum, gum and dip mix. Oh, God. That would um, be the moral. Did you action. jump through the mirror? Yeah, yeah I charged through the, the mirror. Side of the mirror Cody. Come in the you dip. see a plane on fire. Brian, the forces of the abyss and of hell are waging war. A bay, a bay met. Oh, we're, we're, we're in Avernus. No, you're not. You're on Greyhawk. I thought you said I was in the abyss. You see the forces of the abyss and the nine hells waging war. On Greyhawk. Yes. Are there portals that they came from from the abyss and the hell? We don't know about one. Do I see any of that? You see two towers. What color are the towers? It's hard to tell through the fog. Just see the, just the forms of them. Abstract. How far am I from the tower? A few miles away, you'd say. And you're saying there's two towers? Yes. Dang. One of them seems to be surrounded with dead corpses. The other seems to be spewing forth. Spewing forth corpses? Spewing forth like monsters, like oh. demons and devils. That immediately begin stabbing at each other. I can't help but feel like this was n unplanned, but at the same time, it was planned. One of those moments. Yeah. Hmm. Do you want to jump through the mirror? Same uh, thing. Sure. You, you're present right next to Henlo, seeing the same things he does. Which which tower do you think we should go to first, Steven? Um. Uh. Maybe the one spewing monsters, because I'm guessing Vecna would probably be resurrected from all the death and carnage and chaos. Excellent. So, turning off the tower that's spewing monsters seems more... Okay. You guys really want to approach the thing spewing forth literal armies of CR like 19 and some demons. And Believe me, I don't want to. <laughs> You're sure that's where you want to go? No. Okay. Going? You're on there? You're really going to the tower that's... You're not going to the tower that seems to be a safe respite? From the carnage. I feel like this is a trick because I'm remembering Dylan's uh, encounter with the mirror where he picked the small stone and he ended up surviving. So I'm guessing, I'm feeling that like this is probably a similar situation. Well, there's a tower in Greyhawk that's two unleashing towers. demonic horrors across the plane. And there's yeah. one tower that's, that's got to be closed or shut down. We have to fix that problem. I do agree. Okay. So let's attack that okay. and see what happens. Okay. So, Cody, to answer your question, I guess okay. we are running but into... we're like a mile and a half away? Yeah, it's farther to get to the tower that's spewing forth the demons, and the one that is basically surrounded by the corpses of them is on your way. Oh, slightly out of the way. Like, they will definitely stop by the one that's on the way. Yeah, it's basically, it put you about, like, half a mile off track. But right, so we'll approach the we'll closer of the two towers. We'll investigate okay. as we walk. We'll investigate the other tower right, as we walk by. evil, please. I don't have detect evil. What do you got? You I, got I can sense evil. Sense. Yeah. You got some paladin in you, right? We're in yeah. hell. I'm no, pretty no, sure there's evil. No, no, you're not in hell. You're <laughs> on a material plane that's being invaded in by hell. Okay, so yeah. The blood war so is hell spilled is, over. Yeah, so if hell is present, there is evil. Yeah, yeah. 
But so, there's a there's an abandoned tower, a tower full of dead things. Let's see if there's anything living in here. I'm assuming your detect evil planar bad things is now like six miles in area. No, no. How big is it, Brian? Thirty feet. Still 30 only thirty feet. feet? Yeah. yeah, he's a marshal. You know, I'm sixty feet level, Brian. Sixty feet. Hey, it's sixty feet. Good for you. Um, I know, right? Good for me. <laughs> Ooh, thirty more feet. <laughs> Look at it. It's over there. That's a lot. That's a lot. So we slowly approach the tower with his detection running. Yeah. Okay. I can use perception to look for traps. Yeah. You detect two undead in the building. Okay. And something else you can't quite pick up. Uh, can we use perception to try and detect it? No, it's something like you can't quite tell what is it, it is. Isn't telling you what it is. Yeah. Dylan, we need an identifier locate spell, please. Okay. What are you gonna just to locate? Uh, we got a we got an undead demon lord kind of thing in here that we don't know what it is. Well, if it's, Brian's a, pinged uh, it, if it's undead, I should it. be able to figure it out. The, uh, Do you have any rage? What, what effect are you going to be to figure out what it is from outside the tower? Um, okay, from outside the tower, I... Yeah, what magical effect are you going to use? I don't know, actually, so... I, I would assume we, we should just... I guess we should just head in there. Why don't we just go. yell and demand that they come out to us? <laughs> I mean, we could, but I don't think it'll be very well. Effective. Okay. You can try to break through the door. That could also yeah. work. Well, can I determine whether or not the door is trapped or magical? Uh, the door is trapped if you want to use identify or detect magic. You want to use, what are you going to use? Um, can I f just figure out with arcana? No, you need to use a spell effect to figure out if something's trapped. Those are features that spells they really use. Okay. So you guys don't have any of those? Can't tell what it's trapped with. Well, I do have minions to uh, throw at it, okay. so... Oh, yeah! I've they got. get through safely. And wait, well, how many minions do you have? Have you done the math? If you're not, you um, don't have your minions. I think I'm going to have 19 skeletons and a, uh, four ghouls. Okay, can you show me your math where you did that? Um, yeah, it's a... Uh, you had one uh, in the past time. You it, do I'm, I'm still trying to figure that out Okay, exactly, if, you, did, if you have not done your math yet, you do not get your undead. It's the only role I'm using with undead. You have to do your own math. Yeah. I do not know what levels of spells you have that can create undead. I don't know how many rests you can do. I've seen only one. one in this edition. And it's I'm cheating. A, uh, I'm deter I, I can definitely do a uh, 19. I'm just determining how many... You also need to create spells. them. Creating them goes at one-fourth the rate of controlling them. So would you be able to create 19 of them in 24 hours? If so, you'd be out of spell slots. You have 19 third-level enough spells. Um, third-level spells? Third-level and up. Uh, so. I mean, a, uh, um, up, up, uh, doesn't upcast... The, upcast uh, increases and I'll recreate by one. So each level up you go counts as plus one from third level. No, level you can... Um, uh, uh, you, uh, when you animate or re... Uh, uh, four slot or high, you animate or reassert control over two additional undead. Also, oh, third level. Wait, let me check. So uh, if it's a third level, yeah, it's one, I create one. If I'm uh, yeah, using a fourth, I get three... Fifth, I get to uh, five. Dead, a higher levels and test the spell using. You can animate so, or. Um, yes, you can. So yes. Yeah. So works. nineteen. That just ca takes a uh, uh, two uh, fifth level spells and one fourth level. And okay. Uh, so you're going to be missing um, two fifth level spells or, and one fourth level spells. So actually, I'll I'll do uh, twenty. So that's three fifth level spells, uh, and I can get those back with sorcery points. Okay. So you're, um, you mark down all resources you'll be missing due to your skeleton forces. So you only have time for one long rest. Um, Please do your math before sessions going forward, people. Yeah. yeah. So, this is why I hold your single characters. He's got pennies, though. Yes. Let's go, pennies. Great way to do this. Eat the pennies. So pennies your, minions, your minions go through harmlessly. Yeah. So you don't have to detect magic or anything. Identify. We're now in the tower? Yes, you're now in the tower. Uh, you're the wizard. Do you have to take magic? Uh, don't think I did. No. Maybe I, I should. Maybe I, I probably should have chosen that for one of them. Yeah. But um, but Brian. Also, you notice your compass are, is right? pointing towards it. Right. Yeah. So we need to go there anyway. Nice. Okay. We follow um, the compass. Well, yep. All right. But so. proceed cautiously. Okay. So as you arrive, you see Mordecai in. He's basically in a room with a summoning circle, a basically an inlay in the ground where a scepter can be placed, 
couple pieces of the Rod of Seven parts collected onto it, and two s zombies, one of a Draugr, one of a Goblin, scribing runes onto the circle. He has not noticed you yet. Mordekainen? Yes, Mordekainen has not noticed you yet. He's, He's a well-known author, though, isn't he? He's a very well-known figure. I mean, didn't he write some he? books and stuff? Yeah, he wrote a book, or two. He wrote two books, Mordekai's Tom of Fuzz, Mordekai's Monsters of the Multiverse. Bestsellers. He also wrote a, sec a third one, How to Tax the Air. No, that's Daggle Nav, remember? Uh, I keep forgetting these things. Yes, okay. And I, I, I become all fanboy on them. We could you guys have interacted with this guy before. Yeah. yeah. Was we I fanboy see. last time? I don't remember. I think you were distrustful. Ye I was. Okay. We always just sneak, use stealth and sneak up on it. Mm. Okay. So you're going to try to stealth up on Mordkainen? Yes. No. What? But you're going to go up and talk to him? He's one of the best selling officers of all of, of Middle Earth. He has uh, the rod the pieces. Prime? No, Middle Earth. We're not in Middle Earth, we're in the Prime. Uh, he has we need the to go rod to fit. pieces put together. A summoning circle. He wrote all about the one ring. Right? Call him. So I go up to him and say, I've heard all about you, great book, good to see you again. Yeah. And I pull out my copy and ask him to sign it. Okay, he's like, uh, busy at the moment, uh, while also signing it, can you give me the ma remaining broad pieces in your compass? Are we, we need to complete it. Kind of we're a little concerned. Are we busy summoning Vecna? We are yeah. not summoning Vecna. I'm going to use Zone of Truth. What is this truth? I'm going to use it. I'm concerned here, my friend. Yes, because we've been working on this project for a long time, we're nearing completion. And it appears like you've gone off script a little bit here. Uh, small oh, problem. Yes. Uh, the rod needs to be uh, reimbued. Of course it does. With we have the rod. Please yes. give us the other piece. Uh, it needs to be reimbued by summoning the Wind Lords back. So that's what summon circles for. Right. We need. We Why does it need to be reimbued? In summoning the Wind Lords. It's. It's been worn out. It's not at its full power anymore. It can longer. Right. And that's things. fine for our purposes. What we do you mean it's fine for purposes? purposes? It won't. It needs to be at full power if we hey. want to some if we want to get rid of Vecna permanently. Please don't speak his name. You should know. Sorry. Perception check. You mean insight? In yes. I can roll it. I have a plus four. What do you got? Um, insight. Roll insight. Insight. I got plus six. So I rolled a one. Okay. Twelve. Um, the uh, number to beat is twenty nine. Jesus. Nine. For what? For inside. Inside check. I don't trust this guy, Brian. Neither do I. Something's not right. I guess I can try. You can zone of truth. We have, as no, well. we have no, but we have no bards. Oh, you can do zone of truth. Can, he's willing to fail zone of truth. If you want to do that? What zone of truth? It makes it so he can't tell lies. It's or a spell? if he lies, you can tell what he, when he's lying. It's a spell. Yes, it's a spell. It's a second level power spell. It must be nice. Also, cleric. So do you want to do zone of truth, guys? <laughs> do you guys have any he spells? Have, he doesn't have any spells that make. He doesn't Why does he have, have any spells? He doesn't, have, he doesn't have lasso of truth. No, it's not lasso of truth. It's zone. I'm making it. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Hey, um, have you considered maximizing the freshness? <laughs> how does how does one maximize the freshness? Uh, Discard the foil after opening. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Is it crusting already? No. No. Your dad shit. doesn't have enough hands to do what he wants to. He has, he has one handful of chips for the dip, and that's a solid, solid bite. Okay, so. Solid. Uh, does anyone I'm beat impressed. the DC 29 in Some people take one chip out. at a time, and that's the wrong way. Okay, so you guys... But back to no. the dip, he's we need to talk truth. about the I, mechanism I of dispersion. It's 16. very important. And, and and Henry described it as an art. Yes, okay. Um, I absolutely do not trust But I think we need to do artichoke spinach dip next. Okay, we don't have a spell that tells okay. the, that makes No, it you got your... did not pass the inside check. I do not trust this guy. Wait, did you did you make the inside check? No, I rolled this. I got a 16. It seems like Wait, he's telling 29. the truth. He's not lying. You can tell that. I intimidate him. You intimidate him? Who the fuck are you? For reals! Mordecai, he's, he's a Mordecainen. But uh, do I add a no roll is that a, is, He's a Mordecainen. Is that a race or a name? Do you want me to roll? Yeah, I can roll. 13. He's Mordecainen. Mordecainen's a person, by the way. It's not a race. It's oh. just a person. Okay. That's very well known. He's not only a person, author, best-selling of all of Middle Earth. So also... 
the the OC of the game's creator, Gary Gygax. This will argue Dave Arneson made D and D, but that's incorrect. This is a battle in my head. I do not want to give this guy a piece. I do not trust him, even if he is convincingly lying to make him seem make it seem like he's telling the truth. Oh damn! Director, we need your advice. He's gone. Uh, who's second in command? Behind the director. I think you, since they're both actors, I think you're a special effects guy. I'm actor, he's stunt performer, and... He, he, he's had special effects. He actually has, like, a field, so I think he's technically the highest authority at the moment. Okay, so I think no, he can no, just no, wait no, for my dad no. to get back from the bathroom as well. Hey. I'm gonna hold my. I'm gonna hold the sword of. I'm gonna hold the sword of cost to it against his throat, and I'm gonna give him the piece. Give him your pieces. Okay. Yeah. So that way, if he make. So that way, if he does something stupid, I just slit his throat. Okay. So you guys give him the rod pieces. Hold on. Ooh. I'm telling the director. Okay. You're planning to give all five of our pieces to this guy. To Mordecai. I'm. Who's I, sitting in a in the middle of the blood war. Building a magic circle with a durger and what? A durger and a goblin zombie. I have a plan. Zombie! I'm... Yes, he's using zombies to describe the circle quicker. Okay, I have a plan. I have the sun sword literally at his throat, so if he moves, I can just cut it. And what? At the same time, I did. I'm going to use the sleight of. Wait, do we have something that we could disguise as a, another piece? A disguise as one of the pieces? Why would you disguise the whole point is to reconstruct At least one of them. Is there going to disguise it? Yeah, one. So okay, we, roll we, a so, sleight of hand check. So we give him a fake um, one. We roll a sleight of hand. I probably should do that. I got a yeah. plus eight sleight of hand. Okay, okay yeah. Roll, roll it. Because I... Uh, 22. Nice. He sees what you're doing. What? Shit. Ugh. Got this game for a while. He grabs his piece back from your hand. He yes. to. It's like, I believe this is what you meant to give me. <laughs> and he finishes assembling the rod. I still have my throat to it. Isn't that right? Okay, everyone. DC 25 con save. 25? 25? Yes. I certainly This will resist a basically explosion of energy as the rod yeah, comes I can't to make that. I've got a plus 3 constitution, so. Okay. Uh, what are we trying to make? DC 25 con save to avoid and blast back saving throw modifier feet plus 9, actually. From the circle. And what happened? No, how much damage do we take? 17. 17? Uh, you guys don't take damage. Just the rolling back aside from him. I rolled a six. Yeah, you're just at the line. You're Let's flying back here prone. Out. All right, we get blasted out. This is weird. And I as this happens, the circle begins to glow. Uh huh. And you see a spider-like leg crawl out. Then another. Then another. Please say they have an illustration in the book. They put it next to the creature, right? Next campaign, I'm going with my gut and just killing the guy. He's so much kind of demon lord, man. If he's As this pierces through the portal, the spider, I, Miska, spider. the wolf spider. Yes. What and do we know about Miska? Let's do some uh, history make checks, a man. History check. Let's get history. some background on Miska, Brian. This this is this is a problem. Ugh, I I'm not I confident. I got a seven. I got a yeah, three. This is, this is extremely obscure, so it's DC 30. Yeah, 30? I couldn't make that easy. DC 30. No way in hell. DC 30. This guy is from one million years ago. If you guys know who he is. One is million years ago. I got a two. Okay. I no one knows what this is, but you can tell it's bad news. Mordecai and we're level twenty. Miska. We're level 20. We're gods. I seem to recall someone saying. Do you still believe that? I do. Uh, it's not that I don't as know who he, Miska is, it's that I don't care. On the and side. as you say that, some, you see a crown fall off of Mordecai's head that wasn't there a moment a before, and an illusion begins to fade. I somehow get the feeling we've been dealing with Vecna the entire time. It's not Vecna. Strahd. Koss. Actually, I have a sword. That's fine. 
Okay, this is surprising in all manner. Um, he's the uh, guy that ran away, wasn't he? Or no, he's the guy who literally killed the or tried to kill that. Oh, didn't he succeed in killing? Or he cut off his of. hand and poked out his eye, yeah. and then banished him from existence for a very long time. And I think Koss got and the over time. I think Koss also no, he didn't die, but he was destroyed and was banished to uh, the Shadowfell as a. Have as a phantom? No, he was banished to the Shadowfell yeah. as a oh, Lord of Dread. Gas worked perfect. I did it Saturday. Perfect. Yeah. No, my, my schedule is to go either on the way or on oh. the way back. No lines. No nothing. They create enough suffering that often become drunk. Like people complain about lines. But the Bone Lords. That one is particularly good. Have made a deal with him supposedly. He does meet their definition of the betrayal. I was at the Irvine. Oh. So he just betrays the Austin. Off Chambery. The one that we go get pizza at. Right. That's the, like the best cost. I went after book club and it was like like when Prem was like go I'm like I went and it was perfect. Yeah. I can, but I can go on the way too. I go at six in the morning on my way to the office. Yeah. Literally no one. Yeah. <laughs> like, That's when I'm gonna go up. on Saturday. Yeah. Good. Oh, look at We're me. talking about Costco. You gas. have Cos's sword. That's cause. Do your thing. Oh, and then I bought. And as you see, Miska and his horde of who? Miska the wolf spider. Now, what's, we don't know what Miska's the wolf spider's relationship to cause is. Yes. And we don't even know it's uh, the name. We'd rolled the yes, portal. Uh, yes, I know. No, so when she emerges from the portal, key. there's little there's a little blurb on the bottom that says Miska the wolf spider. Like yeah, a movie, right? It, yeah, yeah, it's like a room that says that. <laughs> like a video game, like boss intro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> boss <laughs> intro. So as you say this, Koss introduces. Himself? Or he, he inter him? Hello, I am Koss. I've been playing you for a while. I'm sorry for this. Pleasure. But we do need <coughs> I do offer you something. What do you I offer? I offer us? you a place by my side when I overtake Vecna's ritual. And ascend. You're also looking to ascend as the one true god destroying the rest of the multiversal spiritual beings. Uh yes, yes. So I, I don't know if we've talked much in the past, but I'm kind of on a different team than that. Right? My pantheon of powerful dwarven overlords. Uh, rejects your monotheistic approach and will destroy you. If you wish to oppose me, then Does perish before the might of the true Lord. Okay, before we start prince. making threats that we can't keep, I'd like to point out that we already wield your sword. We've yes. already done work that you couldn't do. So you know what we're capable of. I think that we could talk this through and come to a mutual understanding. I mean... I, th I think you misunderstand the situation. I have summoned a being to which Demi-Gorgon fears. Miska the Wolf Spider? Yes. Yeah, doesn't sound like that tough of a boss, man. I mean, maybe back in the 80s people were worried about Miska the Wolf Spider. Here in the 21st century, man, we've got, like, digital arts, and we are not afraid. Is it, Brian? Is it, can we, can I just kill Miska the Wolf Spider. Oh, boy. So is, wanna, is it Miska the Wolfbiter still in the summoning ring, or is that it? it it's emerged? broken. It's fully emerged alongside. Let's see, what are they? The goblin and someone else. Yes. How uh, many skeletons do you have? 19. Twenty. Alongside. Plus, man. Plus, I got the uh, four. Ghouls. Alongside. Two. Kaku spider fiends, and three Fizari spider fiends. Do we know where what those did they are? say they were out today? Richard showed up, and then they and then he left because Nicole was sick and Shane was sick. Oh. And John? Uh, Michelle was sick as well. Was it Michelle or Nicole that was sick? It was Michelle. Hmm. Cody's getting out graph paper, Brian. This is getting serious. Oh, dude. I don't see a way to do the uh, yeah, ghouls attack. On I don't see a way of us walking out of here. You guys wish to do the fight? <laughs> We, we can just go back to a lot of different places, right? So I can gate us all the way back to where we started. You kind of forget who gave us that key. No, no, no. no I have other gate spells now. Oh. Okay. okay. You guys want to teleport away? Teleport away. No, 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 no. Because we want our rod back. We want to kill Vecna. And if Koss is up to shenanigans, we want to kill him too. But, like, it's probably better to capture him and to talk some sense into him. Because it seems like he's just kind of lost his mind right here. With summoning Miska the Wolf Spider. I'm not that worried about Miska the Wolf Spider. I'm oh, you should be. No, I'm not. I, should we just leave you with the Wolf Spider to talk it out? I think Brian's got the Wolf Brian, you got the Wolf Spider? It's on. 
Okay. Oh, yeah, I mean, you, like, you can summon your own demon lord, right? Yeah, he doesn't have a demon lord. He has a dead god that he wishes to summon. Havoc? Havoc the dead god? I have you a crud ton of Eldritch Blast. From a scale of 1 to 10, how dumb of a decision is this? Uh, with like fighting these guys? Yes. We were kind of railroaded into the situation. We don't really have a choice, man. No. Okay, okay I will. Guys. No, actually, I put us in the situation. I gave all the fucking hard pieces to him. Actually, sorry, I'm just coming over. There's only the two. We got this, buddies. Uh, oh, dear. Okay. Uh, I got this. Uh, okay. okay, so I need my pencil. We're fighting the wolf spider, right? I am okay. the wolf spider. In the event, if before we get KO'd, I'm going to kill him before we all die. Oh, you're, you're pointing to your compadre. Yes, our compadre is the one who put us in here. He's like, oh, the wolf spider's nothing. Anyone with common sense tell, knows that, that is bad. That's it. I'm pretty sure Dylan agrees. Yeah, if we're fighting against uh, what's a, essentially a god... Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, there's more art of Miska the Wolf Spider if you aren't afraid of him. Okay. This is other life. art of him. Huh. What's that guy riding him? him? Is that cost? No, that That's is him. Cost? That is him. He's one giant being. You it's know, all one being. Yeah, if you play Dark Souls with the... Uh, so he's like a, a human and two wolf heads. Human, two wolf head, spider Ash body. Spider. So basically, he's like he's like I mean, the dragon spider we fought before, except there's more. Parts. Brian, you can't be happy with this thing, right? It looks creepy. You, yeah, you put us in the fight with it too. Dude, that's such a good art. It is good art too. That's so good, Cody. And weird. Oh, they're like wolves, and yes. it's a spider, yes. and it's and a human. I yeah, think. I I kill this. Go. Okay, I'm just... So, two sacrifices and two escapes? Yes? Are we going to map this or theater it? We're doing theater, sorry. Theater? Sorry, I did not prep enough for this week. The theater. Don't worry about we'll be fixed for the final week when you guys fight back now. The theater. The theater. Where art thou, theater? Okay, roll initiative. Uh, Six. Brian? Yeah. You were supposed to roll really high. Yeah, 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 yeah I know. Six is not really high. So I need Is it Barbarian, you better get in there. I rolled an 11. I got an Jesus 8. <laughs> What'd you roll? A 5. Damn. Team. <laughs> Someone's better starts rolling higher. I can't help but feel like the person who put us into this fight should go first. Who put us into this fight? Me? No, I was negotiating. You're the one that started handing him summoning things. Everyone, Brian, whose fault is this? Everyone, My role. Everyone told us that he was telling the truth, so I'm like, okay. He's yeah, lies. No. that's one of the crown's effects. His all lies are right is true. Head. Yes. Let's grab that crown. That crown seems good. How yeah. about we grab the crown and the staff and run? Where's the staff? There's no, no, the rod. Oh, the rod. It's in his hand. So yeah. he's holding the rod. Talk to me about the crown just sitting on the ground. Pick it up. Can you wear the crown while you're with the horns? Is that going to be a good look? Well, let's uh, put the crown on one of the undead skeletons and see what happens. Okay. Eh. Okay, dude. That's going to be... I can't help but feel like that's going to be a yeah. nice to watch. Did you eat the whole thing? Absolutely. The next one's going to cost you. <laughs> okay, um... <laughs> Thanks for eating that, dude. Yeah, well, it was sitting around my house. What did you just say? I was going to cost him. Did you say thanks for eating me? <laughs> he said thanks for eating them. <laughs> no, I said thanks for eating me. <laughs> okay, uh, everyone. Initiative. Steven. I rolled an 11. I'm hoping someone rolled higher. Brian. I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, five. Five. David. No, I lied. I have a five. I rolled a six. <laughs> David Ken goes a six. I'm a five. Out of curiosity. Okay. Just out of curiosity, please tell me this wolf spider is undead. Uh, it's a demon. Okay. Uh, I hate everything. Well, I guess there's no avoiding it now. Okay, I guess we're going to our doom. Okay. So up first is 
Miska the Wolf Spider. Oh, no. Brian, he said he wanted to fight this guy. Yeah. No, no, I think I said Brian wanted to fight this guy. <laughs> so basically, you should... Dylan, what are you doing, man? He's hey, uh, trying to... Are you ready? Auto yeah, I'm trying to automate my uh, ghoul's attack. <laughs> oh, excellent, Thanks. excellent. Automated ghoul attack is a good idea. Okay. Brian, he's got a lot of dice over there, man. I'm I still adding. Oh, God. So, odds of one sh being one shot. Hi. Are you ra you're not raging yet, are you, Brian? So you're gonna take this to the face. He doesn't have rage. He's the That's me. Oh, what, Brian? Okay, uh, he's a paladin. He's paladin going. What? You're going to take uh, Minotaur Paladin. I Wait, think. did I get any magic things at, at level twenty? I get any more magic. Okay, you're gonna take two Trident of Chaos attacks and a Lupine Bite. Oh, that's nothing. You got this. What's your okay. class? Twenty. Twenty. Mm -hmm. Can we shield him? Can you shield someone else? You can only no, shield can yourself. Shield yourself. Bring it. So he makes one hit with his trident and one hit with his lupine bite. Alright, alright. Brian, I need to make a DC 21 con save. For poison? Yes. We're immune to poison. Oh, yeah. Are you immune to poison damage? Yeah, we are immune I'm not. from the feast. Yeah, you ate the feast. I did eat the feast. Yeah, every, everyone who's yeah. had the feast is immune to poison and frightened. Poison condition or poison damage? Check your feet, sir. I need to know this. Okay. This um, determines how big of a threat mix guy is. Um, okay, so six, judging by that so little bit of information, this is a poison based feast. Spider. Spider, right? poison. It's it's a creature that partakes against the creature's cured diseases becomes immune to poison and being frightened. Poison condition or poison immune damage? Immune to poison. Just immune to poison in general. It doesn't state condition or damage. It does nope. not provide either. Nope, doesn't say any either. It doesn't specify, so it doesn't give either. It just says you're immune to poison, so this does not give you... Well, you can only be immunity, right. immune to damage. It doesn't, it doesn't give you any mechanical definition for what you're immune to. I think immunity inherently describes something for damage. You can't... But within the mechanics, it does not. I mean, the... I'm immune does. You can't... Get on Reddit, man. Here we go. Poison. Does Hero's Feast grant immunity to poison damage? Yes. The poison immunity is for both the condition and the damage it type. Does who giving this information? This can do on Reddit. D and D Beyond. D and D Beyond. So in the world that so that's wizards. It's an exception, so it works. Woo! Nice. D and D Beyond. I'm reading more of code. There's a lot of entries on this one. Oh, oh it's, it's the forums. Thing. It's forums? <laughs> no, no. I'm in. I'm in. Tell me what you see. I'm in the like the the blog section of you know like the um, blog. So someone from Wizards wrote this. Yes. Is it written by someone from Wizards, someone from outside Wizards? That's all that matters. So this was said. There's no new music. So does Hero's Feast grant temporary hit points? The hero, the hit points gained from Hero's Feast are actually added to the maximum hit points, right? That's yeah, true. yeah, yeah. That's true. I just does Hero's to... Feast grant immunity to poison damage? Yes. The poison immunity is for both the condition and the damage type. But who wrote this? I need to know. Is this by an official worker? At You're asking for source. I'm asking. So it's by Riley Silverman. Does Riley Silverman? December twenty third. 2020. Now you have yeah, Riley Silverman's bio. Yeah, okay, let's Riley see his Tyler, Okay, he is a registered user for six years, four months, and seven days. Last active one year ago. But 67 he, followers, 14 posts. He's a registered user, but he's not a labeled as an official worker of D&D Beyond. The effect does not state you're immune to the frightened condition. We're Jesus. not done. We're not done, dude. There's lots of What's it called? on this one. Hero's Feast. It does not state that it gives you immunity to poison damage. It does not say you have immunity to poison conditions. It says you have immunity to poison. That means nothing. Last cookie? I'll take it. You gotta spoil it with the Cody. Okay. Oh. You're bar probably Barrett splitting these in half an hour. David, you are splitting I break your shoes. You're splitting Every, everything he does. does. <laughs> oh, here we go. Jeremy E. Crawford. Does that work for you? Codes? What? Crawford. Jeremy Crawford. Okay, what does he say? <laughs> Heroes Feast grants immunity to full yes. poison in any form. <laughs> he not Do we have this video? Yes. <laughs> Taylor, <laughs> what? can I get her to email you this? He did not specify if he meant the poison damage poison or poison condition. He just form. said poison in any form. He didn't specify the rules. He I, I'm not done. He wants to go. <laughs> I'm not done. Tell me. Damage and the condition. Okay, then it works. Do you know who? Do you know who this 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 Jeremy Crawford is? 
He is the official rules designer, and his rules are official. You needed to specify that mentioning damage He's and up. condition, not poison in general Cody, form. You I know. <laughs> yeah. Why did you yell at me for that? You hurt his feet. Jeremy you Crawford, you the hero's the poor, spell grants immunity to poison in any form, feelings. damage, and the condition. Jeremy Crawford. Okay. So we're going September to 23rd, 2015. It's almost 10 years ago, guys. We should have known that rule. That's a standard rule. No, and then I'm looking at the what's, posts. I'm looking at more some D&D next stuff, and everyone's like, "Stop it!" Crawford already answered this. Like just ending the thread <laughs> there. What's more interesting? I am ashamed we didn't know this, guys. Okay, Brian, Cody, you're going to take. It. How did we not know? Brian, Steven, Dylan, Dave. I'm new. I knew. I, I, I knew. I'm the one that pointed it out when he started rolling poison damage. I said, "We have eaten heroes' feast. Yes. We have immunity to poison." And you I questioned. Said, DM? A 10-year-old ruling? Yes. Come on, I know. Man. Come on. What's also he hilarious is how mad he got. <laughs> like, this is going to kill him. He, he challenged Riley's cred. Yeah. <laughs> Inexcusable. I love how Crawford also straight out called, called out Heroes Feast OP first. It's a good bad OP, I enjoyed the meal. I don't know okay, about Ryan, it. Those, take, good those little Cornish hens and like the bones. Oh and, my god, those are good. Brian, you'll take 43 points of damage. What? Is that just the bite, or is that also... That's the, the bite and the trident combined. Alright, let's get him. Okay, and now everyone, you need to make a DC 21 wisdom saving throw. Oh, Which one? From his legendary action. Uh, I um, rolled a 24. A, a, a wisdom save? Yes, wisdom save. Advantage. We're all advantaged. What? I, my hero's feast, it gives advantage to wisdom. Oh so my stupid. god, you are saving me. I got 24. Really, um, Dylan? I got so what was your favorite part of the meal? Any specter using a legendary action. Oh Alright, I got a nice wisdom save. What, what was it that you needed to save? Wait, what do I say 21 add? wisdom save. 21, okay, I fail. Yeah, Wait, what take 20 ours? points of damage. Necrotic. What kind of damage? Wait, Necrotic. Uh, Necrotic, okay. Uh, how big is the... Wait, how, how much of an advantage do we get? How many points? Advantage, just roll two dice to take the higher one. Oh, um... And how much damage do we I get? have immunity to necrotic because of my armor. I thought it was armor resistance. It is. Dude, Dude the flavor on this is you such take a half good one. Damage, I believe. So I take 10? Uh, what's uh, the you damage? You take 10. I take, I took 20. How much damage on fail? Yeah. Take 20. Alright, okay. <laughs> and Hostel was... Summon a Spectre. Um, that could... moves us over to the next highest person initiative. That is the two spiders that Miska has. You know, what was your favorite thing about the feast? Uh, cool. Delicious Peach flavor. Great. Any, any dish in particular that you liked? Mm. Oh, the lasagna was heavy. Ooh, lasagna? <laughs> Arfield? Mm -hmm. How about you? What was your favorite chips. dish? Chips. The chips? <laughs> I had forgotten how good sour cream dip was. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, Dylan. Yes. He liked Two the turkey. Two bite attacks are coming your way. By the spiders. You know, I really like right. the salad. Does a the salad was hit. delicious. No, it does not. The Brussels sprouts. I, I felt it was tossed in a little too much. Does I, I picked up the, uh, the charbroiled chicken uh, 19, salad. 19, you said? 19, yes. 19. Did you ever have the okay. charbroiled yeah. chicken salad? How did you not sit up casting that spell a little bit more? Dylan, I think we need a little bit more. A little bit more. It's my spell. Here's these cleric spells. I'm supposed to be casting. You cast it. It's going to be five points of damage. You need to coach Dylan on, you know, you got to live that up a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to take that. Dylan, yeah. What? Next time you cast that the spell, end of the I want a little bit more description of the feast. Yeah. Maybe the table is there. Twenty-one wisdom call? save is another legendary action for Who? Miska. Who? No, he can only do one legendary action per turn. Yeah, this is the next turn. This is the spider's turn, which is just ended. And he's doing a legendary action on the spider's turn. At the end of it, he can do it at the end of every turn as long as he's plus for it. Our guest, be our guest for the hero speech. Okay, DC twenty-one. Put oh, our wisdom service saves, everyone. The Tie the <laughs> napkin no, around save? your neck. DC twenty-one wisdom save. Wisdom. We okay. <laughs> Ten on a failure. Five on a success. Soup, soup de jour. How do do? What are we rolling? Well, Bales. we only live DC twenty-one. Try the gray Wait, stuff, it's which delicious. Which one? Is it necrotic again? Necrotic, yes. Alright, I'm taking five. Wait, Wait, did I did, wait, another one? Is this a yes, he's yes. going to be doing this three times around. He has legendary action points for it. Is this a constitution save? Wisdom. Oh, Well, we have advantage. We have advantage. So this is the second mm -hmm. con save? I rolled a 21. Wrong? Wisdom. So you take half, you take five. Yep. What do we have to, what was our point? 21. I missed, what do I get? 10. <gasps> 10 points of damage? Correct. On jails. Okay. Cost is up next. I'm not enjoying this. We only have five minutes to kill this guy. Take it. 
Steven? Yes. Kill. Oh, cause is gonna. We have lost initiative to everything. Yes. You guys suck. <laughs> He's Cody, we only have five minutes left. Okay, he's going to make three. You were goofing off too much. I'm out next week. What do you mean I was goofing? <laughs> mean? I didn't know goofing off. <laughs> yeah, like seriously, Cody. We were like, let's Does play. A let's play. 39 and, like, no. and a. Come on, Cody. 39? <laughs> no, wait, sorry. 29 and a 32 hit. They both. Does 21 hit as well? I'm out next week. Does he roll I'm anything that's out under out a 17? He is not. And how many attacks does he throw? Three, Three attacks. You're going to take some serious damage here, my friend. Gee, I wonder why. Because you're not raging yet, either. It's so not my turn. I can't rage. I know. You got you're us. going to take... Plus, um, rage hey, wasn't... Hey, quick question. 40 uh, points of damage. Oh, um, well, that's not bad. Uh, quick question. Yes, end of the turn, you guys are going to make <laughs> I'm a I'm at 174. DC, still think it's not bad. DC 21 wisdom saving throw, and he creates another specter. Made it. I got, I got 27. 16 on a, a, a failure. It's not for spells for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is okay. another wisdom check. I'll, also, has How anyone been within, within five feet of me? What damage are you taking? You're taking 16 on a failure, 8 on a success. Which is. So four. it's another uh, wisdom save? Yes. Okay. Everyone needs to make another save? Yeah. Yeah, you, you know, yeah. and I and I reflect back uh, upon that. An 18 that that, that that amazing Fails. dessert. The dessert was good. The stuff nice that you can see through. You know, I couldn't believe the they shallow. made like a mousse that tasted like an Abba Zabba. It was the best. It was okay. the Abba Zabba okay. mousse. Okay, and, and those chips, you're up. Those, those like crumbles that were on Boss top. Is in front of your Chef's face. kiss. Really? You're a bit too close. Kill cool. it with the sword of cost. You have to. You're too close for comfort. I will attack him with the sword. I rage. And I will rage. Rage. Yes, rage, but can't forget the rage. Where's the rage? Where's the rage? You're amazing. Oh, I'm not taking any of these home. Not mine. Not it. Not it. Not it. You gotta lock in the freshness, man. <laughs> Where the heck is my rage? I had more than enough. Oh, wait. I okay. say it goes to house swarm. Okay, so... Really? I, you got the house. So, uh, you, got, you got the peeps. I've got college kids, man. Cost, you killing shit? Yeah. Uh, yeah, they, they lost an initiative despite all having the alert feet. David, this is offensive. It was so offensive, Glenn would not watch it. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't feel it was perfect for life. <laughs> okay, for the okay, for the love of God, please oh, we're tell me. We're monetizing, man. Hits. We're monetizing. This is gonna. Yes. This gets oh, all of the bonds. I would like to. I would like to cut his arm off. <laughs> and Tyler, Taylor, you're okay with me doing this? Yeah, hopefully we're we get. doing what? Posting it on our yes. YouTube channel. I would like to cut his arm off. Wait, you want that? Does you can't on the talk channel? Correct. It's not Andy in the at all. Check. They love okay. tabs. Uh, they love tabs. Who uh, oh, no. yeah. knew? Well, you're lucky. You, you missed me from the I porn that I was looking at. Wow. Well, yeah, I don't, I don't uh, like that. This is a fort. How much did you invest in those my, delicious cheese? Uh, Ten bucks? Two handed. That's five. Oh, that's two bucks each. I thought that was fine. Two bucks each? It's a little pricey. Fourteen plus three for Where else are you going to get a skull shape? You can get a one piece hamburger right now at Wendy's. Wasn't someone talking about one piece? Yeah, but I don't eat hamburger. I don't eat meat. Wendy's is pretty good. But I mean, I would just fill my freezer with that shit. Second attack. But it's one per or. Hey, David. Picture of a monkey grabbing my phone, trying to lick it, and then filming its balls. What? Monkey balls. It's a very inappropriate monkey. <laughs> what? Not, not a... <laughs> what the... That's the way monkeys are friendly. Monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> you guys, you guys yeah, right over get away, it. Man. Man. That's all I, I want. Is, I want it. Don't want it. all I see is money. Don't take it home. It's all I see is money, man. Okay. Don't yeah, yeah, me. Yeah. That's how you get canceled, man. Uh, I have absolved. My, my, my dip duty is done. Yes. Okay. Let's take Glenn home with the chips. You're taking the chips? Steven, yeah. you, you know, got like the an extra hard drive there. Yes. Uh, 15 <laughs> plus my wife. 4 is 19. <laughs> uh, 19. Why would a guy have an extra hard drive? Yeah. Ruffles have ridges. Is that a hard drive? 19 damage? Yeah. No, no, no. There's more. It's got an extra can't hard be a hard drive. drive. It's got an extra hard drive. Can we postpone until next? I'm not here next week. 28 damage. 28 damage. Okay, so that is... Migraine today. This fall is down. Because of my what feet, to your piercing, it allows me to add my I had an MRI for my, for my back, so I had to take my arms. And I brought the migraine on. The piercings were working. I that. also you're have, a, wrong. I think I have right. a third attack. No, you, you do Did not. you start to say you're probably wrong? <laughs> 
Just because your default assumption is that I'm wrong, is that what I'm hearing? I, mean, I got kicked assumption. in the head today. <laughs> it's a safe assumption. Not, you're not physically kicked in the head today. Let's go what what happened? Are we stopping? It's over next session. We're at we'll time. be going to the next person. There's two minutes Did left. you kill it? No. We gotta go. It's oh, Dylan is just like I felt that migraine coming Dylan's out. I took my bed. <laughs> so we're stopping. Who's up next? Later on in the Who's day. up next? I believe so the next person up is... So Causeway... No, I took a nap. I slept. I rested. Did I get the video? Okay. Is the video sent? I'm like groggy. I sent the video on Discord. Next up is Dylan. No, thanks for letting me contribute. So should I... Scary boobs. No, we're stopping. We're stopping. You're up first next week. Deep breath. Scary nuts. No, you're excited. Spooky nuts. Spooky nuts. Spooky nuts. Quick question. Is the... Um, ever, is all the enemies within 20 feet together, or...? I'll have the mat ready next Ooh. week, sorry. New job, good, bad, draw. Because all if they are, I'm gonna be waiting right. poison cloud to It's too early okay, for her to have that attitude. Try the poison cloud, see huh? how it works. They brought uh, in a taco truck today. This is not, uh, I need to wait. Wait, yeah, is you your D&D? Do you not like fire? Amazon 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 Amazon? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to do that, too. Yeah, but, uh, I've got 20 regular minions and four cool things. 24 soldiers. We said you had 20. You said you had 20. You cannot increase 20 skeletons, four ghouls. You never stated you had ghouls. I did. Yes, you not say it until now. No, I said it earlier. When did you state you had ghouls? So At the beginning, I said I'd use a 7th level it. spell slot to... Uh, Are we having uh, another uh, argument uh, where... Uh, 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 so the the necromancers love to argue yeah. about the map. Yeah. 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 Necromancer yeah. players... Yeah. 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 They also like to argue about poison immunity, too. We gotta remember that. We won the poison immunity argument. I know, I know. We're not gonna win the necromancy argument. But he did bring it up, though. He did not... I don't recall him bringing it up to me. Before you challenged him on the map, he said... 19 and 1. Yeah, and then you said, okay, you have to do the math. Yeah. And so he started doing the math. We never went back and corrected for the Spectre. He, he, we said, he, he said he had 20 skeletons. Where's your Mario bag? Taylor? He never stated.